This morning, Blue Origin's new Glenn rocket is finally on its way to Mars with two satellites. The launch comes after several attempts were scrubbed this week due to weather and solar flares. NASA's twin escapade Mars probes are riding aboard the powerful rocket and will be deployed on a 22-month journey to study the red planet. Yeah, everything is bigger in Texas, including cruise ships that leave from Texas with the world's largest planned to take its first trip from Galveston. Royal Caribbean's icon of the sea is set to sail in August of 2027. Travelers, though, can now book six to eight nights cruises with port spots to the Bahamas, Honduras, and Cozumel. And Cheetos and Doritos are about to look, well, a little bit naked. PepsiCo is rolling out new versions of the snack without artificial flavors or dyes. That means instead of signature bright orange, they'll have a more natural pale yellow color to them. The company says the new Simply NKD line will taste just like the originals. And don't worry, the classic versions aren't going anywhere either. You'll see the new options in Doritos Nacho Cheese and Cool Ranch flavors, plus Cheetos Puffs in Flame and Hot flavors. And they are expected to hit store shelves next month. Hey, take a look at this. It's like a scene from the Jetsons. The first all-electric flying car took off from a test track this week in North Carolina, getting up to 100 feet off the ground for a mere $190,000. So you can get a 25-mile range, and it'll hit 60 miles an hour in a car form. Now it's restricted to flying during daylight hours and in non-congested areas only.